this is uh, Darkness Barricanos, also known as Shell Bjorg. This is my second time I ever did a voiceover. We're going to be walking around Morgatown Airport. Uh, I am in my power armor. It's not really... You can tell. I don't have very good power armor. But, it's a regular power armor. Uh, I honestly don't remember much of what I was doing. Uh, I guess I was t taking out this ghoul or scorch up here. It's always trying to shoot at me when I come up here. But uh, I'm using my uh, guitar sword because I think my other sword is damaged. I'm not certain. I can't remember. But, but yeah, I've never been walked around the airport area before. I walked, I've cleared the entire thing uh, from the inside and on around the airport area. But I've never walked around it. And I saw G4 XP do a walk around. And I was like, wow, I definitely want to check this out. <laughs> so, that's what I'm doing now. I'm showing you what's on the outskirts of this area. So right now, oh, and uh, if you see me reading things, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a very, very slow reader. And it may take me longer. You probably, uh, probably uh, will read it quicker than I will. Uh, anyways. This looks nice. Whoa, it's a graveyard. Um, no. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> this is the day after I filmed it. Oh, I dropped a weapon. Sorry, I'm a slow reader. You can just read it, though. I've been collecting like flowers and stuff around this area. Oh yeah, there's a grave inside. Creepy much. And I saw these flowers and I'm like, no. Nah, it's not a grave. I'm gonna respect that and not take them from a grave. You can loot bodies from these areas too, but I choose not to respect the grave too much and just keep on moving along. <laughs> when an event happens coming up here all the time, there's lots of events that pop up at this airport and I uh, choose not to go into them right now because I just want to explore the area. I had all these flowers, I maybe keep one or two flowers and they all rot away in my inventory. <laughs> oh well. Extra fertilizer I guess, right? Oh well. <laughs> I can't remember everything I was talking about. I wish I would have recorded my voice while I was experiencing this. I wish my, uh, my, uh, uh, live stream would work on my PS4, but lately I've been having problems with 
that. Alright, so here's the event. Uh, I'm trying to figure out who triggered it. Was it me that triggered it? Being out on the outside of it? So I don't see anyone down there. I don't see anyone down there, so I'm like trying to figure out. Oh crap. It's the bat. I'm out of here. God, do you not like that bat? I don't want him to even know that I'm here. God. I'm trying to hightail out of there. Nope, nope, nope. Not for me. Not for me. <laughs> do you not like that bat whatsoever? Keep looking up. Oh man, it was circling where I was. Out of here. Here's a question for you. If you don't have Aqua Boy on, or girl, and you're a power armor, you go underwater, will you suffocate? <laughs> uh, I just realized that I didn't have it equipped. And Now I'm exploring the houses around this side here. It's good to explore every possibility around this area. Because some houses you'll think, oh there's nothing up there. But you've never seen all the look the safe. Plastic are the things I'm actually out here looking around for. And wood too, because for some reason I'm really low on my wood supply. I'm still keeping an eye out for that pad.
the water tires are really interesting to me. To me? That looks like a door. Doesn't that look like a door to you? Why would they have that there if it wasn't a door? What's the purpose to that? Being there. Oh, look at that. Well, let's go back to these houses and check them out. Before I go out over there. Yesterday I saw a weird glitch. It looked like uh, green icicles coming off the out of the sky that went across the entire sky. That was weird. are always good to find in this game because that means you have a chance to put your your crap inside of them a guy named Revan or Raven I can't remember how to say his name right but he upgraded that to that my sword's fine. Why the heck I have my guitar sword up for? Beyond me. Uh, he he upgraded my sniper rifle. It's really nice of him. Thank you for that. Again. So the red rockets will have some sort of like bench that you can scrap your stuff at and. Um, and your loot box, your, uh, that thing. So you can just dump it all off. It's always nice to find. I'm sorry I have to do it this way. It's just my PS4 is not allowing me to stream. Otherwise, I'd do it the stream. I'll be doing it this way. Anyways. <laughs> uh, I'm rambling. I do this a lot. So, that wall is the airport. So, I just gotta keep that wall. Well, I think that wall is the airport. 
in mind that that's where he was trying to hide. He was, I, well, I thought that wall was the airport, so I was like, okay, just keep that in mind, that's the airport, we'll just walk along it. But then I realized, wait a second, I saw houses, did I go too far? I'm like, I've never been here to this high school. Um, that, that just registered in that I've never been here, so I'm gonna be here this morning. Now here's a question. Why do you, does this bus have um, all that double bags of money in it? I go into a, a dark room. My light will be already on. Why is it? That's out here. Okay, well, I'll go back. Strange that these are out here. That wall is the only thing standing up. We're like raiders teaching people or <laughs> something, I don't know. It's 
just weird. So one thing I wish that this had was uh, M NPCs to talk to. Figure out what's going on. I'm overcoming someone. I'm really slow. I'm gonna get you if I catch up to you. <laughs> I can scrap the the rifles from here. That is steel and wood. And what I saw through Bolt Girl's uh, video, this place has plastic. That's the main reason I'm coming. I'm looking around is for plastic, because pretty much in this game you need a lot of plastic. Maxwell is mostly uh, melee. This is Maxwell. What the I use guns, but not that as much as I use my melee.
Too bad we can't ooh, yoink, thank you. <laughs> it's too bad that we can't uh take this stuff and put it in our houses like we did in Fallout 4. Although I do believe Phoenix found a way to move certain objects to your house by either shooting them or hitting them. But uh Phoenix and Brace, uh if you if you want to see more about that you ought to go over to her channel and check that out. I just remember seeing a little bit of it. <laughs> that time it worked. Here I'm talking. Well, I'm talking now. But, uh, in the game, the video, I'm actually talking to everybody. What's on my mind? What I'm thinking about? And everything about the where I'm at. <laughs> and didn't pick any of that up. So I'm guessing when you're doing video recording. <coughs> It doesn't pick that up, it only picks up what's on the game itself. If you hear snoring from the peanut gallery behind me, it's my psychotic cat named Karma. <laughs> Sleeping on her bed. quite surprised that this area didn't have any radios playing at all. And then 
I could fit through that hole in the wall. <laughs> now let's go check out that other way. Uh, okay, so oh, that's why. Because there was a wall. Just jump in there with my power armor, but I want to explore every floor as much as possible. Uh, I've never been to this area before. What was that? already there most days to begin with. And Evan... <sighs> Evan... Mom had introduced us just a few months before. Graduated a year ahead of me, just went right to work in the mines. So handsome. 
Oh, and those arms. What West Virginia girl could resist all that? I can't believe he stuck with me. After the funeral, I didn't want anyone around. But there he was, showing up in the library after his shift with a lunchbox for us to share. Every day. When the career fair came, and I met the people from Vault Tech, it was like a light turned on. Protecting families, protecting their future, protecting America. The first thing I did when I got the acceptance letter to Vault Tech University was head over to Mom's grave with Dad. He was happy I was staying in West Virginia. So was I. Sorry, I like listening to those. Thing. So that's the closest thing we get to NPCs in this game. So, I like listening to them. I like reading the, all the notes and the, and on the computer I like reading them. Because, like I said, that's the closest thing we get in this game for NPCs. Come, definitely take come. Helps you slow down your eating and drinking. I don't know why, but it does. Now, when you collect water from fountains, just collect it. Don't drink it. You drink it, bad things happen to you. Huh. You really don't need to pick up bottles or anything for that, too. When I first started, I thought that that's what I had to do. I had to pick up all the bottles so I could collect. Uh, it's not like Fallout well, One that. You can turn baseballs into grenades if you have the, uh, I think it's demolition perk. Explosive perk. All the toys in this game giggle. That's what else I was looking for is to uh, get those uh, 10 points because of the, uh, I was 590 points, that's legitly 10 points away from what I was trying to save up for.
pick that one up, but apparently I didn't. Explain me this. Why is there rat poison over the stove? It just doesn't make sense. Why would someone put rat poison over it? Oh, dash a little rat poison in their food. Won't hurt anybody. <laughs> yeah, right. Be lucky. which way I came from. Well, I definitely didn't come from that way. Or all of these would have been picked up.
out, so this is where the steps would have ended off at. Remembering that there was a a safe in here because of that note just back then, where that kid uh, the kid was talking about how he snuck into the principal's office. I found a key to the safe. Where's the safe at? Because I haven't seen it yet. Sometimes it's good to pick up those notes and read them. Basically, just sc scouring uh, all the scrap I can find. Boy, that skeleton looked like he had a bad time. What happened in this room? Somebody was sleeping. wire here. What's the purpose of that? Like, oh, this, I didn't come in here before. Thank you. 
no, it's those pumpkins over there. I'm like, wait. <laughs> so a lot of plastic here. So if you're looking for plastic and you're playing Fallout 76, come to Morgantown High School. But I'm telling you, you're gonna come out with plastic overload. sure I seen everything I go back and forth trying to decide if I've okay I've seen all of this now so I guess I'll go outside you're enjoying my voiceover. <laughs> I know it's going to be interesting re-watching this before I upload it. Sorry about the loading screens. Really can't do much about it. I guess I could go back and cut them out, but eh. I might do that on my, other, my next one. This is part one of, of two, so it's not that big much of a deal. So we're behind the school now. I'm getting close to the end of the video here. I'm looking for the sign because uh, Wolf Girl made a picture. There, I'm trying to get my camera mode. This is a tribute to Wolf Girl, me taking a picture like this. Because this is what she did. If you like, please hit that like button. If you want to subscribe, well, it's your choice. You're more than welcome to do whatever you want. Um, thank you, everyone, for hanging out with me. It was wonderful uh, being here with y'all. Take care. And. Um, have a great day. Bye. <laughs>